how to add social media share buttons to Shopify. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. I'm going to show you everything that you need to know. So if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to add social media share buttons to your Shopify website. Okay, so to do this, the first thing that you want to do is just open up the Shopify editor. And um, by the way, it doesn't matter what theme you are using, every single theme works with this. So open up the editor so that we can go ahead and make changes. And then as soon as you have done that, what you want to do is go to the first link in the description of this video. Go ahead and click on that and that will take you over to Elfsight. Now on Elfsight, this is the software that we will be using to go ahead and add the social media share buttons to your Shopify site. Now, the awesome thing about Elfsight is the fact that you can go ahead and sign up for free. So all you need to do is enter your email in right here, click on start, and then you will be able to go through and create your free account. As soon as you have done that, as soon as you have signed up to Elfsight, what we then need to do is go up to widgets here at the top. As soon as the widgets section opens, we can go down and see all of these widgets that you can use on Elfsight. And there's a lot of these. So going through, you might even notice some that you want to add that you didn't even think of before. However, we are here specifically for social media share buttons. So as you can see, if we type in social into this top search bar, the share buttons option is going to show up right here. Now, once this shows up, go ahead and click into this. And then right here, we can see a section that says edit widget. So we can choose which template we want to start with, whether we want these to be floating like here, in line, like these share icons, whether we want them to be black, whether we want them to be a list, basically how you want to do this. So I'm gonna select this one. And as soon as your template is selected, click on this. Now the two default are Facebook and Twitter. So we can add these in. We can also add like Amazon, we can add Skype, we can add Reddit. So add all of the ones that you want to go ahead and add right here. And then as soon as that is done, once you have all of the icons, just click on add to website. That is then going to save the widget and give you a preview of how this is going to look. If you're happy with this, click on publish right here. And then it's going to ask you to choose a plan. Now the plan that you choose depends on how many monthly views you get to your website. So choose a plan. If you're new to Shopify or if you're new to Elfsight and you just want to test this out, you can go for this light version right here, which is completely free. Go ahead and select that. And as soon as you have selected a plan, it takes you through to here where it gives us a little bit of code. Now, don't worry, this isn't complicated. It is literally as simple as copy and paste. So all we need to do is copy the code right here. Go over to Shopify. And then as soon as you're on your Shopify website, first of all, make sure that you're not in the header section or you're not in the footer section right here. What we are going to do though, is go to template and add this section in right here. Now, once this opens up, you can see all of these areas. So just go down to the custom liquid section right here. Click on custom liquid. And then that is going to add in this custom liquid section. All we need to do from here is literally paste in the code that we just copied from Elfsight. Let that come across right there. You can see these are now added in and that is how you can add social media share buttons to your Shopify website. 